Okay, so audio sounds fine. I'm Steven with Illustrious Magic, and this is where I explore the NES library because I have a very big gap in my gaming history that involves the NES. Uh, so, we've been playing some of the 1943. I actually just looked up uh, why the energy meter is always going down in that bottom right corner, and it's because it is your fuel. And so your fuel will deplete, and you'll have to refill it uh, by uh, defeating complete red squadrons. Uh, and they will reward you with a power, uh, which will give you a new weapon, or a different weapon, or power up the weapon, uh, things like that. And you basically have to find fuel and use that to uh, um, refill your energy meter so that you don't die. Uh, so you have special attacks which will also eat up the energy meter, but it's always constantly defeating anyway, so it kind of doesn't matter. Um, yeah, so you want to focus on defeating these red squadrons because they will give you power ups. And I am hurting right now. Use a fuel or something. Uh, so it didn't tell me, I just went on the Wikipedia for this game, and it did not tell me where I could find um, the like actual ability or the enemies that like give you fuel. So I have no idea how I can get more fuel, or at least like a good way of getting more fuel. Which sucks. It sucks. Oh, there we go. That's more fuel. Uh, so I guess it's mostly you have to rely on those red enemy squadrons to defeat all of them, uh, which reminds me a little bit of Galaga. And how you have to. Oh, wait, what's Galaga? Hmm, what's the one where. No, it is Galaga, the special, where they would send the special stuff at. I died. Game over. Alright, whatever. Um, in Galaga they would have the special stages where you would have to shoot as they would fly past you. And if you got all of them, you'd get the bonus. And if you got all the bonuses, you got you know, the highest score or whatever. So, Alright, let's see what other NES game we can play. Uh, I have every NES game ever created ever. Um, go for... Did I see track and field? Track and field. Play track and field. Konami. Okay, one player A, one player B, two player A, two player B. Uh, still one player A. See what this is. Uh, Jettle and Bristol's fun. Okay. Uh, so qualify 65 meters. A doesn't. A is not throwing it. So maybe it's start? Or select. I'll try select. Nope. Alright. I'm gonna have to look it up. That or is there. Oh, is there. A... Oh, do they have the instruction manuals? Oh, that'd be so nice if they did. Hmm. Nope, nope, they don't. I'm gonna have to Google it. Track and field controls NES. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Javelin throw. Uh, prepare to press the D pad before you cross the throw line. Press and hold D until desired angle is reached and let go. Forty and forty-five degrees. Cross the throw line. You see the power running your throw. You disqualified. You have three chances. Okay, I got it now. So it's turbo power. 
think I did better. Mm. Yeah. Oh man. That is real good. I don't know if the A button and the B button have separate or if it's the same. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder what one player B is. Oh, this is not going to go well. Oh, I guess that line wasn't the actual jump part. Maybe it is the jump part. Fuck you, you guys. This is whatever. Play something else. Uh, okay, let's play a J game. James Bond, Jaws, Jeopardy, Jetsons, Jurassic Park. Sure. Uh, obviously, ocean developed by Ocean or published. Uh, okay. What is this game? Oh, that's pretty good. I like that. Music on, SFX on, sound off. Hmm. Sure. Dino DNA. Rescue him from a stampede of giant triceratops. Hint. Use the motion detectors for helpful information. Hmm. Oh, okay.
Okay. This is better. I mean, I don't remember this being the movie, but sure. Instead, use the motion detectors for help. Are these motion detectors? Hmm. I have no idea what I'm doing. I have to be doing something wrong, but I have no idea. None of the buttons will open the door and 
Oh, well, I died. Well, who cares? That's <sighs> so weird art, though. Mm, let's see. E. Earthbound prototype. Hmm. Sure. Everyone's always raving about this game. Or mother. What's mother supposed to be? No good. We 
weird. I'm not taking damage, but I felt like I was. Don't worry, I'll fight it. Plant again. We meet. Get again. I dodged. Nice. Oh. That's a critical hit. Guard. Let's get guard. So early in the game, I don't really have anybody. I can't do anything else. That doll's tough. This is weird. Hmm. Wisdom, magic, I guess. Strength, force. Uh. Keypad things with bad, or this game is just. Well, it does say prototype, so maybe that's why. Isn't this? I thought this. Why is it prototype, though? I thought this did come out in the US. I am actually thinking. Oh, oh, oh. Hmm. 
specific things you can check, it's not very super adventure gamey. Beginnings is one that they released on the Wii U virtual console. Right. Okay. So this is Earthbound Beginnings, technically. You can converse with animals. What? Okay. Basement key. Oh. Huh. Okay. That was easy. Please don't get out of my please. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna save this. Uh, oh, here we go. Castlevania save states there. Let's load up that Castlevania actually. Oh, oh not that. Uh, load save state from. No, not Earthbound. Save states, Castlevania 3. Oh dear. Oh my. Oh, I think I have to be in the... I have to be in the actual... Save that thing. Oh, come on. 
Uh huh, uh huh, ROMs. USA. Castlevania 3. Alright, now let's try loading. There we go. Okay. This is, I like this. This is nice. I need to remember how to use my. There we go. There we go. Time. Oh, okay. That'll be useful. I got this. So it freezes everyone. That's pretty useful. Push it for the game two seconds. I like, I like Castlevania. This is good. Music's pretty good too. But I especially like the graphics. Very detailed. Although it is the third one, so they probably got pretty... Uh, good at working on the NES hardware by this time. Oh. I 
hate what is it? How do I load? Load is P. There we go. Alright. I think I'll save every time I get the weapon upgrade because those are like really helpful. I don't want to just like. I don't want to save scum my way through the game. I actually want to like complete it, but not like complete it like people did back in the day. Cause, no, no, thank you. Cool that they have that like secret stuff in there, but also there's no tell for it, and I kind of like that stuff better when there's a tell. That mm -hmm. right. that will inform you of when it's actually there, instead of just being kind of a random thing. Let's do a different game. Let's do one, one more. Let's see, what do I have? Because there's like, there's pirate ones, 
which I don't know, maybe I guess we could check out Arkanoid? I don't know why, but sure. Okay. Always the double balls. They always screw me up, even in pinball. I'm, I'm bad. I'm bad at Arkanoid. Oh, whoa. Okay. How is this not just the same game, though? Oh, whoa, okay. That's why. Nice. This is just like an overpowered version of 1940. Yeah, I can live with this. I oh, would be okay. So maybe if you shoot the power up enough, it will turn into fuel. That would be nice. I'm not 100% sure if that's how it works. But yeah, no, it does. Okay, that's interesting. This is the sort of game where it's like, I'm, I'm never gonna make this unless like, we use a cheat like this. Remember in 2008 when all of the first person, third person shooters were all about PMCs? Remember that time? I, I don't know why. The dumb year. Cheat pirate version of 1943. Uh, what else do we have? We have hacks, Europe, country UNK, Canada, Australia, USA, VS. I have no idea what VS is. Maybe it's just like the 
versus mode stuff. Um, world, which I uh, I don't understand. Hmm. But there's no like Japan folder, which I find weird. Mm, let's see what else can we play. Mm, commando. Sure. Mm, okay. That's some commando. This could be like the top down section by any commando we want. That means a player continue. Like, is this just like a run based game? Like, almost like a robot? Where it's just like, oh, just see how far you can get. Because I definitely am not, like, gonna be able to kill everyone on screen right now. Also, they seem to be disappearing. I'm not sure if that's supposed to happen. do it, but sure. Rush to the second area. Okay, yeah, so it seems like they want, they want you to just go, go, go. I am curious if this is based on Arnold Schwarzenegger moving commando. Oh. Okay. There is way too much going on screen. in my pocket. 
<laughs> I don't know. I just, just is that random. 1991. Konami. Monster in my pocket. Pokemon? you made your own TVs at some point. Is this a CEO? I sent out my while you were watching TV. They will eat you. What? Why would you tell them? Is this like an extension of Monsters in My Pocket storyline? Dracula? You just get bonus points by being able to bring us the end or whatever. Oh, I'm going down the stairs. Okay. I got him. Oh, man. <sighs> I can't have this. 
weird. I, I like the concept of um, like tiny guys fighting. I always liked that when I was a small kid, but I don't know, whatever. Uh, I think that'll be it for now. Um, so yeah, some weird stuff in the NES library, but I'm I'm happy to explore it slowly over time because there's about man, how many files were there? Uh, in USA alone, uh, there are 857 ROMs. So, yeah, 857 NES games, at least for the USA region to play. Um, I probably won't play all of them, but I, I shouldn't say probably. I will never play all of them. But I'll be happy to dip in every now and then, see see what's up. So, follow me on Twitter and, you know, dumb stuff on the side of the thing so but yeah thanks thanks for watching it's, it's, it's been a good saturday <laughs>